Back at the command center, the JW Solar USA in Minnesota. Guys, um, just want to give update into um, the package I was uh, telling you guys supposed to be expecting. This is the package. Is the Outback Valve Cover is called Outback Power System Valve Cover. So let's check it out. This is for the uh, the FX Outback FX twenty five thirty two inverter charger. So this is it. Um, finally, I have to chase the mill guy <laughs> to get it, and uh, they don't even bring it with them. Then I have to go to the post office and get it there because they don't even have it on the delivery vehicle. So this is what it is, guys. So this is the Outback Power System valve cover. I think that's how it's called, according to the styrofoam here. Um, this this one is uh, this is the one that had the turbo charge or the turbo fan. See the FX turbo it says right there. FX turbo. So let's check this out and see what the cover says here. This is exactly what it says there. Outback valve cover. So, yeah, so they're not shipped together, and this is what it is. It has a fan and a, and a bolt on it. So, this side here, this wires go to the aux, the AUX on the inverter, right there. You see this wires and these are the bolts right here this is the fan so what this one does is um, when anytime it reaches a certain threshold and uh, the outback because since it's not vented it's sealed and um, the the temperature it has a temperature compensation as soon as it senses the temperature of the um, the uh, the inverter that is getting hot it has in two, uh, I think it has two internal f fans there. So this is just the turbo fan that blows the air so high to cool the entire cast metal, or aluminum, whatever it is. And uh, this is what it does. It cools the entire outback inverter. So let me take you in and show you what I meant. Okay, we are back at the command center of JW Solo USA. Here are the manuals. You know, don't you just love them? And uh, get it here. And these are the covers for the battery terminals. Battery terminals for the inverter. And um, this is what it is. And this cover, the cover I was talking about, it's going to sit right here and blow the cold air to cool this particular unit right here because it's gonna get hot um, after a while and it's trying to dissipate the heat okay um, those two wires I was talking about here the positive and negative cable the red and black they go in here on the AUX trying to stay away from this glare you see the aux here you're gonna connect it right there so let's see if I can able to show you um, how this thing goes here stay tuned so this cover is gonna pop there you go this cover is out we got some labels here and uh, that's some kind of uh, kind of silicone something like a Vaseline for the wires a thermal whatever it's called it's a warning label and it's the Outback Power Systems powering the planet outbackpower.com and this is what I'm talking about here it has um, there's a jumper right there that sees uh, on and off, and this plug right here, which you can just able to take, 
you have to get it correspond to the thing right there that say the AUX auxiliary. And anytime that turbo fan kicks kicks in, this amber light is gonna come up. So we have the wire tied into the positive and negative of the aux here. So you have one, two. It's okay, one, two, three, four. So one, two, three, four. So these two, this one and one here. So the middle ones, after two, the next two is for the aux. So that's why you connect the fan. So you get these wires here. Um, these two wires hook up to this guy here, this block. Okay. These two wires. Sorry, I gotta show you. These two wires go into the center holes of these. That's where the uh, inverter fan, the turbo fan, hooks up. And from there, it's ready to go. Okay. And if you look at there's a <clears throat> a bridge wire here, and this one's supposed to be here, or else your inverter is not gonna charge. Okay. You have to have this bridge metal here that bridge between the ground the negative ground bonding see that and this if you want to disable that you can just take this one from the chat chat see grounding because it's made for mobile systems like a vehicle rv whatever so you see you can see all the hot out the neutral and uh, you see AC out, AC neutral out, AC out, hot out. So these are all the in here. So this is the grounding, okay? Neutral ground bonding, chassis grounding. So this is what it is. If you have in the vehicle, you don't have to have this grounding on this thing. You have to take this bonding out, okay? That's what I did. Um, the first time I have my uh, FX 3048, that was the, the thing because it wasn't charging. And this piece here, for some reason, was missing. Okay? It didn't, it didn't come with it. I don't know. Maybe it fell off or also, who, who knows? I don't know. So I have to call out back and ask them. So now I have to improvise and use a jumper. They asked me if uh, I have the jumper there. I told them no. He said the jumper was supposed to be there. I said, well, there wasn't one. I said, that's kind of weird. So... They send me something. So this is what it is. So guys, um, we have this guy already figured out. And we're going to have all this stuff back in here till we're ready for um, the testing. So the fan wire is going to go in between here. Okay. To lock in into that thing, that plug. So I just decided to show you guys. Maybe you find it interesting. Okay, guys, this is the voltage on the uh, the fan. This is a 12 volt fan. It's only taking half an amp. As a DC, it has a relay built in inside the inverter that opens and closes. I think it open and close relay. So you can see the turbo fan, FX turbo. So that's what it is. So if you've seen the other previous outbacks, um, I have. Um, this is going to be my what? I think this is going to be my fifth outback. You see the other ones. I have the other one up there. This is my fifth outback. And the three, you guys have seen those in the national, which are the VFX, FX, or OBX. Those are the OBX inverters. Go back into my uh, playlist and you'll see exactly um, those inverters. And um, that project is coming up soon. Stay tuned for that. So, see, that's the other outback over there. And this is the other one. And three I have, which are international ones. So, guys, um, this is the, the, the FX2532MT. And that's the FX3048MT. 
the mobile version. I like these ones really better. So this one's gonna be going, that cover is gonna be going here. And uh, you see, it's gonna sit like this. Stay tuned. That completes the entire process. So this is the, the outback valve cover. So this is the cover. See that? It's just a cover and it cools the entire thing here. And um, we get it seated here. And voila, it's good to go. Well, didn't you like? If you like, do sub subscribe, like, and um, share the videos. Live from the Command Center, JW Solo USA in Minnesota. Thanks for watching. Love you guys all. Bye.